talked yet, so I guess I better start. I don't know. Oh, yes. First of all, say hi to Misty. Hi, babe. How you doing? Oh. Thank you for this clip that I'm able to mount this phone to to do the recording with. If I'm right, this phone does record in 1080p stereo sound. So my voice should be coming from the left. Or mostly on the left. So I'm out because I need some more vape juice. Even though I'm being a bad boy right now and actually smoking a regular uh, cigarette. Which I need to stop doing. Because once in a while I just want a regular cigarette and I have one. A pack usually lasts me two to three weeks. So. Oh, thanks for a car turning right that made that go left. Or made that light turn red on us. been going down College Street, which is one of the main streets in town here. Of course, it's been raining all day. It started last night. Nice and warm in the 70s yesterday. Sunny. Now it's like in the 40s and raining. Yay, yay, yay. Now we're getting on US 65. Which is sometimes called Lexington Avenue here. And turning on to Walmart Drive. Key. Going to the vape store, going to the vape store. Because the post office and UPS and FedEx have all decided to ban shipment of vape supplies under the guise of safety. Yeah, you know what? Take that guy's safety and shove it up your ass. It's just another way to try to control the people. So, you know what? Take a quote from Peter Griffin. Post office, USPS, UPS, and FedEx. Y'all can kiss the fattest part of my ass. <laughs> Get me some vip and juice. Y'all gonna be by yourself. Bye.
Welcome back. I'm back. They're having a blowout sale. Their house juice today was for a 60 milliliter bottle, $2.99. Great deal. Great deal. So I got me like six bottles. Some McDonald's. So I want some McChickens. Oh. Let's see, I forgot what this street is. It's another Indian name. It's another tribe name. I forgot what it is though. The Apache's further up. This is Navajo. This is Navajo Drive. Going on to West Vist. I assume was a long time ago. It used to be old Mo Highway 20. Back in the day. We're talking like the 50s. The 1950s, 1960s. 60s before even this US 65 came along. This is going around town and back before I think 63, 65 ran through town. And then I think in 63 they built this curve around. If I remember correctly. Oh, oh shit. I ain't got time to stop. Especially in the wet roads. Oh, god dang, potholes are getting big. are going on <laughs> I can't see because okay 28 minutes so we will see how long um, or how big the file is going to be on this I'll pop it up on the screen about now um, so we'll see how much that or how much yeah the file sizes are. Yeah, my the clock on this thing for the time running is in the upper left hand corner, so that's why I put my hand there. Because it's white lettering and I couldn't see it. Yeah, I need three McChickens and that's all. Or no, actually change that. Change that. I want to, um, well, no, yeah, make it three McDoubles. Sorry. Or three, da, ah, three McChickens. I can't talk today. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, just three McChickens. Thank you. 
Oh my god, I had a retard moment. Confused McDouble and McChicken. There's too many Mcs and McDonald's. It's hard to keep them straight. right there was probably a perfect example of some of the things people with mental disorders deal with. Your brain can't keep up with your mouth sometimes. Good lord. Taking a long time. she was going to cut the line. No, nope, she's not trying to. She knows I was first. Okay, good. If she'd cut the line, she'd have gotten mine through the chickens, and I would end up gotten what she got. I'm assuming it stopped because I ran out of space on the device. So I have had to switch to the external storage, the micro SD in there. Uh, internal storage is 16 gigs, but like. I'd say a good six of it is used for the actual device. So that only left me to like, I don't know, 10 gigs. And it's ate that up. So the micro SD in here I have is an 8 gig and it is all pretty much empty except for a few megabytes. So, 
that kind of blows. Well, I'll try to figure something else out. Now, I remember a long time ago, this thing started acting up when I was recording to the micro SD. The audio video got out of sync. So, I guess we'll find out if that still happens. piece these two together and um, uh, gosh dang it I forgot what I used oh dang it Movavi I used Movavi video editor 12 which I bought I got cheap <laughs> Got it on sale. I got it for like 39 bucks. I like it. It works pretty well. Just like a lot of video editors. It's not user friendly very well. Just like a lot of video editors. And there goes somebody darting on across in a Honda. It takes a little while to get used to and figure things out. I mean, I am still a very novice with it, but I know enough to get done what I want and need to get done. So, That's it for this trip.